Today, we're going to do a quick test to see if EE mobile data is as quick as they say it is. Let's put on Wi-Fi. Right, and I'm going to go to a browser and I'm just going to check it out to see. Go to a browser. Uh, let's type in just anything. Hello world. See how quick it comes up. Right, that's pretty quick. But as you know, Google is quite quick. Let's, let's click the first one. See what happens with that. That's pretty fast. This is a dual core phone, so it will be pretty fast. Right, so now we've done that. You can see it's quite quick. Let's see if EE uh, mobile data is recognizably slower. Turn off Wi-Fi. Right, go to mobile data, which is on already, right? Go to privacy, clear browsing data, clear. Right, we'll clear the browsing data. So there's nothing in there. Now let's try it. It's on mobile data. There, 4G. Google. Right, this is with mobile data, right? Now go to Google. And what do we type in? Hello world, right? Hello world. Click that. Hmm, that's pretty fast. That's pretty fast. And press hello world. Mm, that's that yeah. It loaded up pretty fast. It's it I suppose Yeah, I can give it that. It's pretty fast. But okay, let's see how let's go to YouTube, let's see how quick it does something there. Okay, let's let's play something. Fix Android tablet right and we'll play this one here it's mine see how quick it plays so it's pretty fast it's pretty cool it is pretty cool there's no buffering and stuff and it does pretty it does load up pretty fast that's providing let's pause that that's providing that you're in a uh, 4G coverage network. That's what you must uh, re see. See, it says 4G. If it says 3G up there, you're not going to get that speed. That's something that I've noticed. You don't get that speed when you're up there. But as as um, all the buffering and stuff, it doesn't happen when you're actually in a 4G area. It's pretty fast. So rate, comment, and subscribe, share the video, and I'll see you again.